Hi all folks, this is Max from GalaxyNexusRoot.com. Um, today we're going to learn to put Clockwork Mod Recovery on your rooted Galaxy Nexus. Um, it can be the GSM or CDMA version, um, the Unlock version or the Verizon 4G LTE version. Um, first what you want to do is um, make sure you have your phone rooted. If you don't know how, I have instructions for both GSM and CDMA over at galaxynexusroot.com follow the directions, root your phone and when you're done rooting um, we're going to put it into fast boot by turning it off alright and then after it turns off you're going to hold down the volume up and the volume down and then hold down the power button until you get the um, the open stomach android logo which will happen here Give it another second, and you get a little beep, and there you go. And it should say unlocked at the bottom. Um, once you're done that, um, connect your micro USB to your computer, and this can be done on Mac, Windows, or Linux. Next, what you're going to do is download Galaxy Nexus Recovery.zip, um, and you get a bunch of files. Try to put it somewhere where you can easily browse to. I put it in my C drive, or you can put it on your desktop. Um, next, open up a command prompt for Windows type by typing cmd under um, start search. And for Linux or Mac, open up a terminal. If you don't know how, Google it. There's a bunch of instruction on how to do it. Now we're going to browse to the directory that um, we just unzip the files to. If you zip unzipped it to desktop, you might you don't have you can just type without the backslash. That's actually backslash this way. That's my Korean font. That's not a W. It's a backslash. Um, CD backslash Galaxy Nexus Recovery. If you put it into the root directory of C drive like I did, or um, if you're on Linux or Mac, you might have to do that, or might, maybe without it. Um, just wherever you unzipped it. Anyway, do that. Once you're in the um, directory, all we're going to type is fastboot. Um, let me see here. We're going to type fastboot um, flash recovery and recovery dash clockwork dash. Here, let me make this bigger. No, I can't do it. Dash uh, magro, maguro dash gsm, okay? If you have the um, gsm version, which is the the um, unlocked um, European Asian version. If you if you don't have that and you have the Verizon one, do the Toro dash CDMA the file ending in. So I'm gonna do the GSM since I have the unlocked GSM version, and this will flash the recovery and hit enter. And also for Mac or Linux, you might have to uh, you'll have to enter like dot slash and do. You have to use the Mac version of Fastboot, and for Linux, use Linux like that. That's pretty much it. Um, now let me run this, and it should flash the recovery, Clockwork Mod recovery for um, my GSM Galaxy Nexus. And if you if you get OK, writing OK, you're all good to go. Um, and it says Fastboot status OK down here. Um, if you didn't get that, then you, you don't have the um, drivers installed correctly on Windows. Um, so install drivers on your Windows. Uh, for Mac or Linux, it should work fine. So we can double check the re uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery is working, and this is how you get into it. Once you get into the fast boot mode, hit the volume down, um, volume down again, recovery mode, you see that, and then you hit the power button. All right, and that will get you into recovery, and that's how you get it. You can always get into it. Volume up, volume down, power button. Get into fast boot. Hit the volume down uh, twice and the power button. So this is the Clockwork Mod Recovery. Um, this allows you to install ROMs, backup ROMs, restore ROMs. Um, it's an essential tool you need to flash new ROMs. Um, so anyway, that was how to install Clockwork Mod Recovery on your. Galaxy Nexus GSM and CDMA versions. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel here at um, Zetomax on YouTube, and also you can subscribe to um, Galaxy Nexus 
root.com um, our email list to stay updated on the on all of the updates all right thanks y'all and subscribe see y'all later